Here we are, day two at the Lower General Fishing Lake, the, the day after the quiz. Well, we hammered it at the quiz. Luckily, we had Graham on our team, the school teacher, me and Jez. We chipped in, but uh, without Graham, I think uh, we'd have been last. But it's about three o'clock in the afternoon. I'm just rising from my pit. And look at this. I'm going to jump into the uh, jump into the little plunge bowl here. Water's chilled and will certainly help me shake off this fuzzy head that I've got on here. Last day, so Jez is flying back to work tomorrow. He's off to Egypt. And then I shall be uh, flying back to Bangkok, grab me truck and get back to Pattaya on uh, Sunday afternoon. I'll get back and have a roast dinner or something, we'll see. But um, I think today we've got some, uh, got some bread here. Lined up, that's my uh, coat hanger, and uh, we're gonna do a little spot of fishing. I'm, I'm hoping maybe get Predator Rod out. Jez has got some um, African arowana, some uh, arowana, the Asian arowana, um, and some Saloween Rita catfish as well. Um, the African ar arowana and the Saloween Rita catfish are two that I've never had before, so they'd be nice. Have a crack with them on a little dead baits and that, and toss it around. You got to try and avoid the the red tails and the leopards and and a few of the other fish that are um, in more abundance. Got a bit garami coming up down there. Now. I don't know if you can pick him out. Oh, he's seen me. He's gone. Um, yeah, so it'll be a few hours this afternoon into the early evening. Uh, Jez did mention popping down to the Louis uh, sort of walking street tonight. They do some. Nice little night market, do some ribs and some some nice food and that. So uh, that'll be nice. Hopefully get that on the end of the video as well. Um, I'm going to jump in that plunge pool. Get your head sorted out. See you later. Yeah, a chilled out morning. In the, in the plunge pool, walking around the lake, getting some sun on us, getting rid of the hangover. And we've got a cracking kapow. We've got a, a mushroom dish there. A uh, pad head, I reckon. Might be cold. It smells lovely. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at that fried egg. The lake behind. Oh, what a morning. Well, we got some exciting vibes here. There's basically some very special fish in this tank just about to go into the lake here. And we got three golden dorado here from the Amazon. Lovely black bars in the middle of their tails. The Julie's there, and there's the, the rock baku, is it? Yeah. Which is another type of ripsaw, and that'll be the fourth type going in, I believe, on it. Yeah, fourth yeah. type going in. Yeah. Holy Lake in Thailand to have a rock baku in the lake. Yeah. Uh, which is perfect, and then we'll try and get some more yeah. if they're available. And then, uh, yeah, well, I'm looking for one more ripsaw, and then there'll be five types of ripsaw in our lake. Lovely. Perfect for anglers that yeah. are into the ripsaws, you know? Yeah. Those Dorado. The Julian's there was caught yesterday and had a just have a little, little bath and just looking after him for a couple of days. Make bath. sure he's alright before he goes back in. Yeah. Cracking stuff. There's the rock back here in the corner there. And, uh, it's a very, very special rip saw that one. Yeah, we'll have a good look at him in a sec before he goes in. There's a Dorado. Look at them, very fast swimming fish. They look like look like huge trout. And the speed they're going, they jump as well. <coughs> I'll be cracking. Additions to the lake, there they are. Three of them going around together. Just literally swimming rings around the Julians. These are Julians. Chill out. There's a rock back there. Oh, he's fast. Oh, look at that, very special fish. Is there a rock baku? Where's this one from, Jess? Uh, Brazil, Amazon. An Amazonian. And another type of ripsaw. Lovely. Different head on him, like a Saloween Rita head. And a, a ripsaw nice. body, yeah. but he's got lots of new features in here. Red tail as well. But they are characters. Squeaky fins and grunter. Beautiful fish. Let's have a look at the other side. Lovely, isn't he? He's beautiful. Yeah. Here's the other side. Fantastic. 
Oh, a little mouth, aren't they? Yeah. Very different to a ripsaw. Yeah, completely Very different. different. Yeah, yeah, and they get like get really fat. They do, yeah. yeah. And like I said, they'll probably be like fully grown, probably yeah. about five times the size of that. Yeah, yeah and it's cracking fish, man. Amazing. It is, yeah. Hope to see you again when yeah. you're massive. Let her go. Yeah, man. Yeah. New home. Welcome to Lloyd Jungle Fishing Lake. Yeah. Chop D, chop D. Yeah. He's a tricky customer. <laughs> He's a tricky customer. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Look at that. That's a Peruvian ripsaw, Jess? Yep, Peruvian ripsaw from the Amazon. Colours on each of those those bars. Each each thorn has got a different colour. Again, a mouth similar to the Rotbacco. Smaller than the ripsaw. More in front. As well. Amazing looking fish, aren't they? And these will get big, yeah? Yeah, they'll get big, man. Yeah. Yeah, they'll probably get about, ooh, about 28 to 30 inches, maybe slightly bigger. Yeah, because they're in a lake. Yeah. Yeah. So, nice, yeah. Beautiful, beautiful really, yeah. really beautiful rips yeah. in. Yeah, from Peru. Amazing. Awesome. Yeah, man, cool. Vibes, man, vibes, man. See, like the slime that he lets off as well. Yeah. Did you see that? I did notice that. Yeah, he's beautiful, Hang isn't he? <laughs> A spider's web. Yeah. Come on, mate. Chuck D, buddy. Chuck D. Here we go. What have you got here, then, Jez? Arrow albino barbel. Yeah. Very, very special. Yeah. Beautiful fish. And you get pretty much nearly the same size as a big grass carp. And these are the same barb we get in the rivers in the UK? Yes, yeah. mate. Lovely yeah. things, yeah. Absolutely cracking fish, yeah. Yeah, yeah they'll do well in here. Yeah, they will. They will. Especially if uh, somebody's a species angler, so be uh, be good for something, them. yeah. Because uh, well. pretty sure uh, there's not many lakes that in Thailand that actually have them. No. Um, so yeah, so if anybody's out there that's a species angler and wants to target these, feel free. Yeah, Misty Harvard letting them go. That's the first one. We've got two of these, haven't we? Yes, mate. And then there's another ten in the stock pond to go in that we're just growing up, get them a little bit bigger, so and then they'll go in. Let's have a look at the other one. Oh, he's, oh, he's there. out there. There he is. Yeah, there he is. Yeah, these are the two bigger ones. So you got another. How many more have we got in the stock pond? Uh, ten. Another ten. Yeah, another yeah. ten to go in. Yes, yeah, so they're the two big ones. Yeah. So There's very nice fish. Very, very beautiful. Ooh, nice catch, Harvey. Nice catch. <laughs> yeah, lovely. Lively. Wee! Yeah, wee. <laughs> yeah man. Yeah. The... Yeah. Right. Golden Dorado from the Amazon. Jez, you know about these. Feels oh, like these a are trout beautiful. In my hand. Yeah, freshwater salmon. Yeah. Absolutely an amazing fish. All right, bright yellow, uh, black tail, a little bit of red. Lovely, lovely teeth, as Ooh. we will see shortly. And he's lively. And he's very lively. And they are a very fast lure fish. They love to be lure mm. fished. They do, and they'll smash the predator, uh, the uh, little Javas and the tilapias in here. There's the teeth. And there's the teeth. Uh, wee. Yeah, yeah. Let's see if we can get, get his teeth again, yeah? Yep. Again, yeah. Let's see. see his teeth. Absolutely cracking fish. And yeah, they're super, super fast. Yeah, amazing. Well, amazing looking fish. Yeah. And we got another two to go in. Wait, should we get a picture of them? Yes, we do. Oh, oh, hey, oh, oh, this oh. is numbers two and three of the Dorado, the Golden Dorado. The first one went in just now. And here are the other two. So we got three in here now. Hello, everyone. <laughs> Lovely. Okay. Yeah, yeah, let them go. Lively. Win it. Nice. Let's see, give him a brush move and a splash. Yeah. <laughs> 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 quality. Brilliant. Quality. Super awesome. cracking fish, that one. Tight line vibes. Oh, big time. Yeah, John got, 
bitey finger vibes as well. I it's, was, uh, uh, like... Pod said, just pop your finger in there, see what it's like. And I was stupid enough to do it, and he, and he, and he did Sorry. bite me. Uh, 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 not much coming out there now, Sandy. Yeah, there was. Uh, it looks a there lot was, better than yeah. yeah. But, but uh, <laughs> yeah, no one's that stupid, <laughs> apart from me. Oh, good luck. Mm. Awesome. For good luck. <laughs> There we go, the new fish have gone in. What time is it? Any idea? About five o'clock, is it, maybe? A bit later than that. But we're gonna have a look at that. Pond's got a red wine. Cheers. Yes. We've got a big beer each. And we're gonna have a, as the sun's going down, have a couple of hours fishing or hour and a half fishing. See if we can get something different. What a cracking day. <laughs> <laughs> We had a fish right in the, against the bush in the corner there. And, uh, of course, it might be something different. Yeah, it feels good. Double hook up, pond's in. We got, oh, a little garami. I've got gotten on, yep. Yeah. On me chest. <laughs> go her army's in the net and pond's got a swai i'll go around and give her a hand with that one okay pond <clears throat> okay On smashing it. Got third fish, I think. Got bubbles. Bubbles do Stay, staying down a bit. <coughs> Let's have a look. What you got? It might be a baduk. Yeah, I reckon it's a baduk. There we go. There's Pond's baduk. Nice fish. One of the grey ones. There she is. Difficult to hold, very tricky customers. Almost jumped a couple of times, like trying to pick up an eel. These buggers, Wee, there he goes, <laughs> and they do jump. <laughs> Is that all right? yeah, we won't do much. We won't oh, the lights a bit though, forgot to put the light on the camera, just took to possibly a red tail. Well, we've got some very strong grips all. No, I, sh I should know I should have my light on me on my camera. I must nip back and get it. Nope. Oh, no, sorry, I, I got him. No, no, I don't think so. Yeah. What you got? Oh, awesome. That is awesome. What is the it? first one to have one of them. What is it? Uh, a, a vulture. No, not a vulture, a Bruno. Bruno cat, eh? There we go. Oh, it's a marble, isn't it? Yeah, it's a marble, yeah. Yeah. That's the first one being caught as well, on your rod, mate. <laughs> This 
That's not one of the big girls, is it? No. No. Don't look too bad size though. No, it's 20 odd pound. Yeah. No, no, it's just a bit awkward in the corner of the mouth. Which is out, yep. There we go. Got a marble catfish and a red seal catfish in the in the cage at the same time. Brilliant. There we go. Look at that. A a marble catfish, a red seal catfish. The uh the beauty and the beast, <laughs> and not just the fish. <laughs> Brilliant. Awesome. <laughs> awesome, yeah, awesome, Super. yeah. Don't see the marble Brilliant. come out. There's only three of those as well. That's lovely. Well, mm. On a bit of corn, that one, in the they, corner. Yeah, lovely. Yeah, they have grown a bit, yeah. haven't they? Oh, I'm glad we put them in the lake. Yeah. Look at the whiskers look at, on look it. Look at the length of those whiskers. Beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, cool. Mm -hmm. Nice red tail as well. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. This one. yeah, nice red tail, John. Yeah. Yeah. Super. Yeah. Awesome. There we go. There we go. The last morning. And that is a fry up. Look at that. Mm. Jesus. That's going to set us up for the day. Maybe the week. Yeah. Absolutely brilliant. Beautiful sunny morning. Actually, clouds just come over a little bit there. Just as I said that. It was bright sunshine as I walked across. Uh, that lake's looking lovely. Uh, and, uh, yeah. Let's get me coffee, get stuck in. Back home now, unpacked and uh, settled in front of the TV. Just want to say thank you to Jez and Pond up at Lloyd Jungle Fishing Lake. What a fantastic trip. We had loads of vibes, time in a plunge pool, loads of great food, catching loads of different species, seeing loads of new species that I've never seen before being stocked, pub quizzes, trips to the Skywalk, trips on the Mekong, the, uh, the walking street as well at Chien Cam, absolutely fantastic. So if you're out and about, get yourself up to Louis, have, uh, have some days um, at the lake, getting on the vibes, have some great food and catch loads of different species. Um, so yeah, once again, thank you much to Jez and, and Pond for a fantastic trip. And uh, I look forward to getting back up there again. Um, 